Hi, I'm Sabrisi. I'm from Abdin. Today I have skincare empties for you. And yeah, let's start the video with this one. This is my favorite oil cleanser. This is Neutrogena Deep Clean Brightening Cleansing Oil. The brightening part, I, I didn't see any brightening effect with this cleansing oil. Maybe a little, maybe just a little. But as an oil cleanser, this is really good. It emulsifies well, it removes makeup, sunscreen. But one thing I don't like about this cleansing oil is that it stings my eyes a bit. That's all. Except that this one is really good. I'm gonna buy this again. I really loved using it. The texture, everything. Love, love, love this one. So next I have the shower cream from Plum. This is their Vanilla Vibes range. It cleanses my body while not stripping the moisture. I think for winters, shower creams, shower oils can be very good than those, you know, extremely foam-based shower uh, gels. Okay, so next I have a face pack. This is from Detoxy. I didn't like it at all. It looks kind of dirty. <laughs> Need to clean it up. I'm gonna buy this again. Finish this using on my body, on my face but didn't do anything for my skin i just don't like this one so next i have clear's midnight blue coming cream i really like this i have been using this for two years on and off gonna buy this again i use this a lot especially in the winter because it has this thick texture and it is so calming so soothing so now i have this cosrx propolis ampule didn't like it because it didn't do anything for my skin i love the ingredients and all but when it comes to the performance i didn't see any there are better soothing and hydrating serums or ampules out there and this is quite expensive as well not gonna buy this again didn't do anything it felt nice applying this one but when it comes to results it felt like a very average liquidy gel on my skin this didn't do anything for me um so next i have the vanilla vibes body scrub uh, it's my favorite if you know my channel i keep on buying this one and i found a very good way to use it so the thing is this vanilla vibe scrub the granules are made of sugar so when you rub it on a white skin what it does it melts in like five seconds so what i do with it now first i take some oil and I massage it on my body then i apply the scrub and i massage for like three to four minutes with the scrub and after that i use water so this way uh, the sugar particles they last for longer and i get better exfoliation plus uh, moisturization so you can try this trick and you know, it might work for you it worked for me you can massage the scrub for like two minutes if you find this to be kind of harsh but yeah with oil it works like exfoliation wise it works quite well but you have to use a lot of oil you know you can't use like few drops of oil on your body then you can go with this uh, scrub no you have to use quite a lot of oil for this scrub to work so oil scrub water then wash off something like that and yeah let me know if you try this uh, method if it works for you or not and one thing you can use this for your lips as a lip scrub this scrub it works really well as a lip scrub so next i have another scrub this is from Sentio, very thigh body scrub i did not like this much the emulsification is not well with this mask because the oils were separating it was messy to use didn't see much difference and it smells weird it has tamarind in it um no not gonna buy this again so now i have this plum so smooth frost mask this is okay for soothing hydration wise is okay i mean average you have to use squalene or some other things with it for better result but for winter i don't think i'm gonna find this to be helpful so for now i'm not gonna buy this uh, for summer time i may buy this again okay now i have this serum from overdermis this is their vitamin b serum i really liked it if you are a niacinamide beginner then you can find this to be helpful this serum it has 0.5 percent panthenol 5 percent niacinamide then it has probiotics overall i really enjoyed using it so now i have a body butter this is from himalaya it is the rich cocoa butter body cream actually i really like this one this is affordable moisturizing 
value for money i do recommend this one and yeah i'm gonna buy this again and during the winter i think it's gonna be really good this body cream it feels like body butter you know next i have this plum hair mask it is the avocado hair mask and this is a decent product if you want soft and smooth hair you can try this one the texture is good i enjoyed using this it was a good hair mask no nonsense decent okay now i have this cetaphil night cream this is their bright healthy radiance i really love this one it is very moisturizing my skin feels glowing moisturized with this night cream i use this during the daytime as well works fine with sunscreen and yeah very good uh, product i'm gonna buy this again for sure it has good amount of niacinamide then vitamin e very good texture doesn't feel sticky doesn't feel greasy just enough moisturization and it gives this in a glow to my skin love this so next i have a sunscreen from minimalist this is their spf 60 silymarin sunscreen they have two sunscreens now and this one is my favorite i love the texture and everything about it people have complained that it balls up something like that so i made a poll and many people they share their experience and tips and you might find that to be helpful and on my skin it doesn't wall up or something like that i really love the texture i love everything about this sunscreen so the last thing that i have is this one this is a bioderma pigment bio night cream and if you want like very minimal uh, skincare routine you don't want to use much actives serums and all so you can use a cleanser you can directly use this uh, cream because it has a good blend of actives like vitamin c vitamin e then few more antioxidants i actually expected this to be a thick cream but it has this gel consistency and about removing pigments or pigmentation from skin when i used it i didn't have dark spots so i cannot comment about that i used this because i wanted extra glow to my skin it like gave me the glow to some extent but i feel that i use actives like serums in my skincare routine so i don't need this cream separately because it already has a blend of like actives then i'm using serums that have actives so for moisturizers i want to keep it like very simple at max i want it to have niacinamide mostly ceramides and in the mostly moisturizing things and this is kind of expensive so i won't buy this again because i don't think i need this in my skincare routine because i already use serums and all but if you are like someone who want to keep their skincare routine minimal then you can just use a cleanser then you can go in with this um, moisturizer or night cream but for me i don't think i'm gonna buy this again you know or if i want to start a like skincare routine that is minimal maybe i'll use it but not for now so i'm gonna like review this in details i also use their arnica sika bio cream and their pigment bio cleanser and i'm gonna review very soon because i keep on delaying it i want to review these things for like last two months you know but keep on delaying keep on pushing the date i don't know why so yeah that's all for now i hope you found this to be helpful thank you so much for watching and see you very soon bye bye